Hey, what's going on, Who That Nation? It is yours truly, TJ Jones, the host of the State of the Saints podcast. And for a few minutes, I want to talk a little bit about a report that I read. And this was on NBC Sports. According to writer of NBC Sports, Curtis Crabtree, the New Orleans Saints have really strong interest in linebacker Jamie Collins. Now, for those that may not know who Jamie Collins is, uh, he spent the majority of his career with the New England Patriots. Um, he left the Patriots, I think, due to a trade with the Cleveland Browns. He played one year with them. And then he went back to the Patriots. And he had a really good season this season. I'm looking at these stats. I got them written down here. 81 tackles, 23 assists, 7 sacks, and 3 interceptions. He's a 30-year-old linebacker. He doesn't turn 31 until October 20th. He's a really smart linebacker who that nation. And this is something that the Saints really, truly need. Um, You know, I feel like the New Orleans Saints, they're going in the right direction when it comes to linebacker play. If you've been following the Saints for the past six or seven years, you know that's something that has been lacking. Uh, the New Orleans Saints linebackers have had issues covering running backs, covering tight ends. And it seems like they have the one answer to the question in Demario Davis, a guy that they got through free agency and has done nothing but just you know, be one of the best leaders of the team and being an all pro. And I understand that AJ Klein is an unrestricted free agent, but who that nation, I might say something that's controversial to some, but if I had a choice to get Jamie Collins or keep AJ Klein, I'm going with Jamie Collins. Jamie Collins is not the fastest guy in the world, but he is going to be where you want him to be. He's a short tackler. He's a guy that has good uh, ball skills. I mean, Three interceptions at the linebacker position. I think maybe even you return one for a touchdown, if I'm not mistaken, I think in a game against the Miami Dolphins. This is what the Saints have been looking for. You need those smart linebackers. You need those guys that you don't have to worry about and, and question if they have the, the fortitude or they, they have the energy or the motor, or the motor to uh, perform at a high level. And that's what you'll get with Jamie Collins. Um, normally, you know, I look at the age of a player and I'm like, nah, I don't know about that. But if you look at the success and the scans on the wall of a Jamie Collins, this would be a really big pickup for the New Orleans Saints. And, you know, you combine him, you know, with veteran leadership, you know, with his experience. I mean, for somebody like a Caden Ellis going into the second season, I think this can help him elevate his game, you know, being such a young player. And I think that the New Orleans Saints would have that, you know, that weak side linebacker that they've been missing. I mean, you have Demario Davis, who's been playing outstanding at the middle linebacker position. And now you have a good weak side linebacker, a guy that you can count on that plays sideline to sidelines and is not going to miss many tackles. Um, so if the Saints have an opportunity to get Jamie Collins, I think this would answer a lot of questions that we have at the linebacker position. And I think it would be a really good move for the New Orleans Saints. But I would love to hear from you. What do you think about Jamie Collins? Uh, what do you think about him possibly joining the New Orleans Saints? I ask that you comment down below, like and share this video. This has been the State of the Saints podcast. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel, youtube.com, search The State of the Saints podcast. And also, man, I want to encourage each and every one of you uh, to check out my brother, Emmanuel Jones, artwork, man. Y'all know I plug my brother most of the time. You know, a guy that, uh, you know, I look up to, I admire, probably one of the main reasons, you know, I know so much about the New Orleans Saints and sports in general. So um, he's an artist, man, down in New Orleans, man. So if you're into art and all that kind of stuff, uh, y'all check out his page, EmmanuelJonesArt.com. That's E-M-M-A-N-U-A-L JonesArt.com. And also you can check out FineArtsAmerica.com. And see some of his artwork, man. So um, I'm going to put it down in the description box for those that are watching on YouTube. Um, just click the link, you know, check it out. Maybe you'll, you know, see some stuff that you like. But my brother is an incredibly talented artist. And, you know, I love him to death, man. Like I said, he encouraged me. And he's he's my hero, man. So if you like the State of the Saints podcast, you know, I have to say it's because, uh, you know, uh, me trying to be like him growing up as a kid, man. So y'all check him out and, um, you know, tell me what y'all think. But also, once again, comment down below and let me know what you think about Jamie Collins. Uh, the State of the Game podcast is available on YouTube as well. Much love to you and thank you all for supporting the State of the Saints podcast. I am TJ Jones, the host of the State of the Saints podcast. And all I got to say is...
Hude.